so much focus this morning heading into this week on Gary Cohn, the head of the National Economic Council for President Trump. He's a guy who was the president of Goldman Sachs, uh, didn't work on the Trump campaign at all, but he's emerging as one of the top figures in the Trump administration in 2017. A big Reuters profile of him out yesterday. Uh, take a look at some of Gary Cohn's fingerprints and you get the feel for exactly uh, what kind of influence he's having on this administration. Others are down. Gary Cohn seems to be ascendant. Uh, the president signaled that he's open to keeping Janet Yellen on at the Federal Reserve. That appears to be uh, at the behest of Gary Cohn. He also changed his stance, as you just heard there, on naming China as a currency manipulator. That's something that folks on Wall Street haven't been so keen on. And of course, as you just heard, uh, it plays into the geopolitical situation as well. A couple of other things that Gary Cohn has apparently had a stamp on. Uh, the Trump team has apparently scrapped its tax plan and now starting from scratch with an entirely new uh, proposal, abandoning the ideas that they had uh, on the campaign trail. We'll see where that all goes. And then Politico is reporting, as you guys mentioned earlier in the broadcast, that uh, Gary Cohn pushed to hold off on firing uh, the head of the Consumer Financial Protection Bureau, Richard Cadre, uh, but now may be signaling that he wants him to go. So uh, Cohn very much involved in all that. So who is up and who is down? Clearly, uh, Cohn is one of those who is up. Down would be Steve Bannon, uh, Sean Spicer in this administration, and also up uh, Jared Kushner. That's the president's son-in-law who you see in that picture. Uh, Jared Kushner is somebody who has been ascendant in this administration as well. Of course, he was mocked on Saturday Night Live over the weekend. We'll see what that what impact that has. Those Saturday Night Live mockeries do seem to have some impact here on who's up and who's down inside this administration.